Hey, do you remember when Rockstar accidentally did this? With the new Tuners DLC in GTA Online, something rather odd has happened to the standard Karuma. The standard Karuma is now totally bulletproof. All of the windows around the car are completely bulletproof, meaning the person inside will not take any damage at all. If you don't remember, it was when Rockstar made the standard Karuma more armoured and bulletproof than the armoured Karuma when the Tuners DLC got released. It was eventually patched, but after many months. Well, in true Rockstar fashion, they've gone and done it again with the Sterling GT. The whole car around the windows and doors is 100% bulletproof. The red you can see here is from the game files, denoting bulletproofness, a word I just made up. You can even use your own weapons while inside it, like a pistol or even sticky bombs. However, it can still be blown up from just one explosion. But that's not the only mental thing they did to this car. They gave it an HSW upgrade that you can get at Howe's Workshop. Hey, what's it gonna be? And this now makes it the fastest car in the game. That's right, a car based on a Mercedes-Benz 300 SL and the 300 SLR cars from the 1950s and 60s is now faster than those based on the fastest supercars in the world. And it's not even close. In a one mile drag race, the Sterling GT absolutely trounces any other cars in its sports classics class. It leaves all the top sports cars for dead as well, with the exception of the S95, but the Sterling does have an extra top speed of one mile an hour. and is only ever so slightly slower in a one mile drag race compared to the Devastate, but again beats it for top speed. This is just mental that they've made this car the fastest in the game, but also bulletproof. Talk about OP. The bulletproofing, of course, will be patched at some point, but we just don't know when yet. A real quality of life update would be to have the entire vehicle range in the game balanced to more closely resemble their real life counterparts. But this is Rockstar we are talking about, where common sense doesn't normally reside. On the plus side, it has a great sounding engine and is actually pretty fun to drive. You can buy this car from the legendary Motorsport website for $975,000, but you're looking at at least another $200,000 for the upgrades. The special upgrades are only currently available on new gen consoles. So if you found this video useful, please drop a like and maybe consider subscribing for more. I'm Beats Down, and I'll see you in the next one. Oh my God.